always tracking, always alerting. Here's your StormTrack 15 weather. Welcome back. 517 looks like we could be tracking well maybe some rain chances later in the day uh, we are going to get a check of everything you need to know yeah, let's kick it on over to storm track 15 meteorologist adam olivier yeah you know alex ryan right now not a great start to the day out there because we have a lot of fog around it's very damp and humid well that is going to be continuing here for the next few hours if you're headed offshore today we will be picking up some of those winds too out of the south 10 to 15 miles per hour now you can see that we have a good deal of cloud cover expected here through the morning time those temperatures in the mid 60s and we are going to be looking at a lot of that fog still lingering about until around eight nine o'clock our queen city of the tesh camera here showing that we have that fog out there at admiral doyle and lewis streets our camera sits high atop the community first bank building there but you can at least see down to the ground a little bit that fog likely will thicken up in the coming hours ville platte new iberia really seeing that dense fog showing up a lot of clouds out there beside the fog as temperatures have settled into the mid 60s that's kind of where we're going to stay here now our future cast is kind of indicating we could have some coastal showers. I think that's more of that mist that hangs around in the atmosphere. But as we get later on to the morning time and towards midday, I think there is the potential for a few of those showers. In fact, by 10 o'clock, it starts picking up on that. Now, there will be a few peaks of sunlight out there, but overall, today is just going to be a gray day. Midday, there are those showers still pushing their way on through. Temperatures will climb generally into the mid-70s for daytime highs. There you go with some of those passing showers continuing here through the afternoon. Uh, hours before settling down this evening. Temperatures won't be falling much once the sun goes down either. So a lot of clouds out there. The potential for a shower or two. Again, not the greatest day to go find your perfect Christmas tree as temperatures climb into the mid 70s. Tonight we're looking at those mid 60s once again. And then on your Tuesday, well, more warmth out there. No rain to track. Sun and clouds will mix, but a high near 80 degrees. And in fact, that's going to be the case Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. There's not much change. Maybe a, a little better opportunity for a few showers there on your Wednesday. The next best rain chance comes next Sunday, but this is a very warm and humid week. Very spring like each day. The coldest we get mid 70s. So hope you're prepared for those warmer temperatures. Yes. We're always prepared. I yeah, feel. yeah, I love the idea of it. Thank you, Adam. We'll check back in later on.